Can you generate automatic YouTube thumbnails using AI? I tested two of the very best AI image generators and the thumbnail that you just clicked on was entirely created by using them, but not in the way you might think. AI is already changing the way that content is made in 2023. Right now, you can use AI models like ChatGPT to write automatic YouTube scripts, YouTube descriptions, and even generate clickbait titles for your content. But what about those time-consuming YouTube thumbnails? Wouldn't it be great to just type in a prompt and get a usable image in seconds? Now, sadly, whilst ChatGPT can generate some good thumbnail ideas, it can't actually design an image for us. But luckily, there might be another solution. AI artwork has been blowing up over the last few months with software like Midjourney and Dali going viral for their hyper-realistic and often creepy looking results. They work by simply allowing users to type in some text, hit enter, and within seconds you get a selection of images that were automatically generated from scratch purely based on your prompt. So you want a rabbit riding a bike? You've got it. Superman eating cereal with Captain America in 1914? No problem, if you don't look too closely. So what about a YouTube thumbnail? Well, let's find out. The first image generator I'm gonna try is Dali, which was actually created by OpenAI, the same people that brought us ChatGPT. And to get the best results out of any AI software, you need to use the right prompts. So if we just type in a YouTube thumbnail, you'll see that the results are pretty terrible. I think it's tried to go very literal with this first one here. The second is at least heading in the right direction, but this just shows why there's a reminder above the search bar to enter a detailed description. So let's get more specific. A YouTube thumbnail for a video about creating AI thumbnails. Okay, these are still not great. The first one is interesting though, because it's tried to do a sort of before and after image, which is a very popular trend for YouTube thumbnails. The second one is just terrible. The third is okay. Again, you can almost see what it's trying to do. So let's try a YouTube thumbnail for a video called, can you make YouTube thumbnails with AI? Oh my God, check this out. Only kidding, I made this one earlier. These results are still absolutely terrible. And you're probably starting to see some of the big problems that we're gonna face with this process. First of all, the faces. Dali is absolutely terrible at creating realistic human faces. Second, it can't generate readable text. And third, the images are square, which is no good for a YouTube thumbnail. But we're gonna deal with some of these issues later on, because first, we still need to get our initial prompt right. So let's step away from asking specifically about YouTube thumbnails and instead describe in detail what we want to see in the image. Now, you might be thinking that's all well and good if you have an idea for a YouTube thumbnail, but what if you don't? Well, that's when we can return to our good old friend, ChatGPT. Give me some YouTube thumbnail ideas for a video called, Can You Make YouTube Thumbnails With AI? Now, straight off the bat, we have some really strong ideas in here. Number two, three, and four especially. So let's copy one of those descriptions and paste it back into Dali. I'm just gonna edit this prompt slightly to make it a little bit clearer. So we'll change it to an AI robot holding a camera and taking a picture for a YouTube thumbnail. And these are pretty cool. I really like this fourth one especially, but it doesn't look like a thumbnail yet. So let's try another prompt from the list. A person sitting in front of a computer with a look of surprise or amazement on their face as they see a thumbnail being created by an AI. And we are getting much closer now. These are probably the best results that we've had so far and the prompt doesn't even mention that it's a YouTube thumbnail. Now, as good as these designs are getting, I still think there's a bit of an issue with the faces that it's generating. And we also still can't change the size. So we're really pushing the limits of what Dali can offer. So this is where we're gonna leave Dali behind and try our our luck on Midjourney. Midjourney is probably the best AI image generator around at the moment, so I'm hoping we're going to get some better results. So let's start by adding that last prompt into here as well. And straight away, look how much better these designs are. All of these images have captured exactly what the prompt described, and despite a few wandering eyes, the faces are much better quality. Now, I really like this third design, but there are a few problems. It's still the wrong shape. So you can change the aspect ratio on Midjourney by typing in dash dash AR three by two. Unfortunately, it won't create 16 by nine images, but three by two should just about be okay for YouTube thumbnails with a little bit of editing. We can also ask it to create
create the same image in the style of a YouTube thumbnail. And these designs are now really, really close to being usable. Honestly, it feels like we're just a step away from finishing, but we're still missing the most important thing. Me. If I upload an image of myself, copy the link and add that into my prompt, will this finally create our dream thumbnail? Something that can replace the laborious task of making clickable images from scratch? The answer is no. We're just left with some honestly very scary images and we seem to have ruined all of the progress we've made so far. So sadly, I think we're left with just two options. Either use one of the images without me in it or generate every element of the thumbnail individually. So prompt a separate background, a separate subject and all of the other elements with AI, which we can then bring together using Photoshop, which means I can also add some readable text, which Mid Journey can't do either, by the way. So can you create a good YouTube thumbnail using Using AI? The answer is yes, but to get the best results, you're going to need to have some human input as well. Right now, AI just can't replicate the knowledge that you have for your YouTube niche, but this tech is only going to get better. And making a great YouTube thumbnail isn't even the biggest time waster when it comes to creating content. If you want to learn about five easy ways that ChatGPT can speed up your YouTube workflow, you need to watch this video next, and I'll see you guys in the next one.